Hi everyone, this is Prema, working as Assistant Professor, Department of Computer Science, Kesar College of Arts and Science for Women, Tirshangur. Today we are going to learn about Java programming. First we are going to discuss about Java Evaluation. It was developed by Sun Microsystem in 1991. A Java is a high level programming language and it runs various platforms such as Windows, Mac OS and various version of Unix. So Java is a platform independent and it is designed and development developed for a, uh, electronic devices like TVs, VCRs, toasters and other electronic gadgets. Next we are going to discuss about Java tokens. A tokens are nothing but the smallest individual unit in a program is known as tokens. Tokens are classified into five types. They are keywords, identifier, literals, operators and separators. A keywords, a keywords has a special meaning in a Java. It can't be used for naming a variables, classes, methods, functions and so on. And it is written in a lower case letters. Example, by classes, do, if, uh, for, and so on. Uh, Java has a 16 word, uh, sorry, 60 word as a keyword. Next, we are going to discuss about identifiers and literals. Identifiers. Identifiers is used for naming a classes, methods, variables, object, labels, packages, interface in your program. Uh, and next we are going to discuss about literals. Literals in your Java are the sequence of characters that represent constant value to be stored in the variables. Next, we are going to discuss about operators and separators. A operators is used to manipulate the data and the values. A operator is a symbol that uh, takes one or more arguments and operators on them produce a result. A separator, separators are a symbol used to indicate where group of code are divided and ar arranged. Example, parenthesis, braces, bracket, brackets, semicolon, comma and periods. Next we are going to discuss about constant. A constant refers a fixed value that don't change during the execution of the program. Constant divided into two types. One is numeric constant and second one is character constant. A numeric constant further classified into two types. Integer constant and real constant. A character constant further divided into two types character constant and string constants next we are going to see about data types a data type specify the size and type of the values that can be stored in the variables a data type classified into two types one is primitive in, uh, another one is non primitive a primitive further divided into numeric and non numeric non primitive divided into three type so one is string and array and user defined methods. Next we are going to see about variables. And a variables is a identifier that denotes a storage location used to store a data values. A variable name may consist of alphabet, digits, underscore and dollars characters. Operators Next we are going to discuss about operators. Operators are used in a program to manipulate data and variables. Thank you.